Hi everybody, Greg Meyer, Product Manager for Brakelades here at Hunter Engineering. I'm standing in front of our P10 Innovation Award winning BL bench lathe. So what's new with the BL lathe, you ask? Well, first I want to talk about what's not new. The bench lathe basically has been the same design for 25 years. You may think that's strange that I'm saying that, but it's important with a bench lathe that it be a solid and heavy, heavy piece. If you think about machining tools, mass absorbs vibration. This is essentially the same design we've been selling for 25 plus years, and that's very important. Incremental improvements, but basically the same functionality exists. One of the things that's, that's great about this lathe is the ability to switch from drums to rotors so quickly. In this case, I'm in the position for rotors. All I have to do is loosen up this nut, move, swing this out of the way, and now I'm ready to start machining drums. So it's just that easy. The other thing that uh, is new about this lathe is the tablet interface. So this is our premium machine. When you buy the premium machine, you get what we call Digical, which is the digital measurement system, and the tablet, okay? So you say, well, why do we need a tablet on a bench lathe? Well, the best thing that this, that probably the killer app, if you will, as the kids say, is the ability to, to select specifications. So all I have to do is pick the vehicle that I, want to, that I want to work on here. In this case, I'm going to select a Buick. And when I do that, I get the specifications. I get minimum rotor thickness, discard thickness, right? Even things like caliper torque, um, but, uh, as well as the number of studs, bolt pattern, lug nut torque. A lot of useful information is in this, uh, in this spec lookup as well. So the other thing that's really nice about this is the display, right? We can display much rich information. We can give them animations showing the technician what to do. There are training videos present in here. But probably the other thing is this, this thickness display right here. So in this case, I'm in the green, I'm good, but let's say I'm working on this, I'm cutting, cutting away rust and grooves in the rotor, and all of a sudden that turns red. Now I know that this is below specification and it needs to be thrown away. That's very important. Yes, a technician can read the specifications on the side of the rotor, and he can use his caliper, but those are all chances for error. This, all he has to do is select the vehicle, and we make it extremely simple for him to use, that, use this lathe. In addition to that, we also have features like Bitminder. Bitminder keeps track of when it's time to rotate the bits and or replace them. That's a very useful feature. Um, things like the setup guide. This shows me how to set up different rotors uh, and drums on this machine to be, to, be, um, to be machined, as well as things like, as I mentioned before, training videos. All that is present uh, inside the tablet. So all very useful, make the technician more productive, uh, more profitable for your shop. I also want to mention that this lathe is also now HunterNet capable, okay? So I can connect this to HunterNet 2, and provide information. We can make printouts for customers showing the vehicle that we worked on, the rotors, the minimum initial, uh, the specifications, the initial and final uh, the rotor thickness as well as run out. So very useful information. This is not only available on this machine, but also on our premium ACE lathes as well. So thank you for, very much for watching. Have a great day.